Hi there, welcome to the I'm Ready Test Kitchen. My name is Lauren and I am so excited that you are here watching this video today because this is one of my absolute favorite drinks. We are going to be making a spicy banana rum punch. For this recipe, we'll be using our spicy banana beverage infusion. Our beverage infusions are packed full of the real fruit, so you know there's actual banana in here and it actually contains the uh, pepper that makes it spicy. We'll also be using our grenadine premium syrup. I absolutely love our premium syrups, especially this one for adding into cocktails because it's naturally colored. Your cocktail isn't the healthiest thing, but if you wanna avoid using artificial colors that you normally would find in grenadine, our grenadine syrup is a perfect option. It's also not super sweet. We don't emphasize on the sweetness in our syrups, more so on the flavor. So you're gonna get a big burst of flavor without all that extra sugar. So with that being said, let's get started. Let's make a rum punch. My first step here is I'm going to pump in my spicy banana beverage infusion. Our spicy products are very spicy. So depending on the level of heat that you like, I would say use anywhere between one and one and a half pumps. I want this to be spicy, but I don't want to breathe fire after I drink my cocktail. So I'm going to use just one pump. And then I'm also going to be adding in one pump of our grenadine syrup. And now, since this is a rum punch, let's add in our rum. I have here some 151 rum. We'll be using one ounce. Oh my gosh, I can already smell the banana too. This smells so good. And then just some regular um, clear rum. And we're gonna save our dark rum for last. So one ounce in. Next up, I have one and a half ounces of orange juice and we're going to do another one and a half ounces of some pineapple juice. Now just do half of a lime, juice that in there. And lastly, I have a little secret ingredient here. We are going to put in some freshly ground nutmeg. You can use regular just ground nutmeg that you have at home. Just do a pinch of it. So you don't want a lot, nutmeg is a pretty um, potent flavor. So we just wanna have a touch of nutmeg in here. So let's add in our ice and give this a shake. Let's shake it up. Setting this aside for right now, I have our glass here. I'm going to fill this up with some ice and then we will pour in our cocktail. All right, let's pour it in and we'll give it the finishing touch of a little dark rum float. All right, perfect. So our final touch here, because what is a rum punch without a little extra punch of rum? We are going to float on top some Meyer's dark rum. I'm going to give this a nice garnish. Here I have an umbrella, a party parasol, as uh, they're actually called, and a lime wheel. And there you have it. A rum punch. Cheers. Let me give it a try. Wow. That is so delicious. This is just like such an awesome, refreshing, delicious drink that you can enjoy during the summer, of course, perfect for the summer, but drink it in the winter. Put yourself on a tropical island, mix yourself up a rum punch and pretend you're basking in the sun. Well, thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this recipe and you do give it a try at home. Be sure to let us know in the comments below what you think about it. You can also subscribe to our channel. That way you will never, ever, ever miss any new recipes like this tips and tricks, or testimonial videos from our amazing customers. Make sure to follow us on our social media as well, at Amoretti on Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, and Pinterest. See you next time. Bye-bye.